Hello, my name is Rafdeep Shodi. Currently, I am working with the leading bank as a forensic investigation officer. My career uh, started 18 years back, and uh, my area in uh, area of interest in infosec uh, started with web hacking and security profession, along with a cyber crime investigator courses. The these courses I did basically I wanted uh, to know both prevention and the response. In my current job profile, cyber threat intelligence is a very important aspect and because I am dealing with incident management and forensic investigation. Most challenging uh, role in the intelligence and cyber threat intelligence is the data analysis and the reporting, the intelligence reporting. It should be actionable because, uh, for example, we need this information for SOC we need this information for incident management team and as well as for the higher management. So this information should be actionable for their particular audience. And at the same time, uh, this information, the, uh, the intelligent information has to be presented in a specific format for their uh, specific audience. We cannot uh, uh, give the information what soft or the what incident management team has required uh, to the higher management so this information to be specific for their audience which is very challenging for the technical people especially to write the reporting aspect of it. how CTIA has benefited CTIA has benefited in data analysis intelligence reporting and the disseminating the evaluation results so basically uh, it has helped in uh, writing the reports and disseminating the evaluation results because these days technical uh, professional like us they generally face a lot of challenges in uh, the intelligence uh, writing and intelligence reporting with respect to the their specific audience so cti has actually benefited me in, in the report writing and the data my experience while preparing for the cti program is that the course content is very sequential and it starts from scratch and basics to the advanced level so this has actually uh, helped uh, every student to you know and that it starts from the basics and you understand the as various aspects of threat intelligence and then you move to the advanced level so that this the course is very structured and sequential also the uh, labs are very important and helpful in understanding the various concepts because this field is something where you need to do more hands-on than theoretical and I'm glad that the EC Council has keep that thing in the mind to provide the labs platform to their students which can uh, which will definitely help them to understand the various concepts in the threat intelligence. The three things what I really liked about the CTI program is that the trainer who has actually explained the concept in a very detailed manner and the labs are also very very explained in detailed manner the course content is uh, really good for the professionals uh, like us uh, who deals with deals with the cyber threats on the daily basis and the third most important thing is that uh, this program is uh, really mapped or you can say compliant with the uh, published industry standard frameworks intelligent frameworks so these three things I really liked about the CTI program. Uh, I have done other certifications other than EC Council certification like uh, CHFI also I, I did uh, certifications in InfoSec field I, in governance like compliant IOC certifications and also cybercrime investigator web hacking professionals and ISO certifications. So what I felt is that CTI has a very unique uh, way especially a structured approach has taken by the CTI program and to make the uh, students understand from the basics to the advanced level. So this is uh, really unique in the case of you know to provide the uh, structured way for building an effective and threat intelligence. What skills uh, CTI has actually helped in uh, in my workplace is that what I have learned through the labs during the lab sessions uh, what I have understood is the what kind of the plat platforms are used for the uh, intelligence and IOCs advisories and understanding the IOCs 
and it has actually helped me in the incident management forensic investigations and also the uh, creating the risk management uh, reports so basically uh, this has actually helped me to identify and mitigate the business risk uh, which uh, i was doing earlier also but now i i am doing it more in a uh, structured manner how does uh, cti helps in the career progression i really recommend this course for the students and the upcoming uh, students in, uh, in in this field especially the cyber crime investigations forensics incident management and uh, risk management then uh, penetration testing so in every aspect of every field there is a aspect of intelligence because uh, ioc you deal with the iocs on your daily basis Uh, in in your uh, career, if you're working in the infosec field, so uh, to understand what are the IOCs, how does it uh, work, what are the motives behind it, and the intent and the threat vectors, uh, threat actors. So all those things you will you will learn in this uh, CTI program. And if you are working in SOC or you are working in any of the cyber security prof- professional. fields i'll I recommend that cti is really help you in your career progression i would suggest to the students uh, who are uh, preparing for this exam cti exam that they should write down the important uh, points uh, for each module whenever they are preparing through the course content it really helps to you know go back to the course content and check for the important points through the particular video and also uh, i'll suggest that do the labs along with your course content rather than uh, waiting for the labs to uh, your course to complete and then go to the core your lab sessions and uh, in your cti uh, exam that uh, cti uh, your program you have six modules so similarly you have six domains in your exam so i'll suggest that you may also focus on data collection data processing and analysis along with the other modules and uh, the lab sessions please do it because it helps you to remember the concepts and the last what i will advise you that you give the exam as soon as you uh, clear or you uh, complete your the cti program which really helps you you know to clear your exam because it has actually helped me so i'll suggest the same to you Thank you and all the best